something imitated. Never motherfucking duplicated. That's right, your boy's back. The motherfucking voice is here. Okay, folks, for those that know and for those that don't know, I'm the motherfucking voice wolf. But hey, I had to come on here and eat a little motherfucking crow, man. Gotta come on and eat a little crow. I gotta eat a little crow, god damn. Oh, god damn. The motherfucking Pittsburgh Stiller, but really, I, I didn't do no trash talking at in, anybody. Just because it really was no Pittsburgh Stiller trash talkers. But I'm still crowing. My Carolina Panthers got their ass kicked. You know, I just. I do things that apparently a lot of other motherfuckers don't do around this TTC shit. But I'm giving out my crow to Stiller fans. And all these motherfucking Stiller fans on my job that I talk big shit to. That don't damn matter. My motherfucking Carolina Panthers, I, we're starting to run across a little injury bug, but injuries is no excuse. You guys remember that. And remember that little token. Injuries are not an excuse. We're having some little nicks here, nicks there. We still have to pull through it. We might have to take... I don't know if we need to sit Cam down until he heals all the way. I don't know. That ain't my job to, to do. But I'm trying to figure out, hell, are we better with a 70% or 60% Cam... And you know, 100% Derek Anderson, I don't know. But it's quite obvious with Cam and our offensive line situation and our running backs with these injuries that we're going to have to we're gonna have to go to the drawing board because we're about to hit the gauntlet of our schedule, Panther Nation. Oh, we're about to hit the gauntlet. Yeah, as you know, I'm on my way into work, so you get it how you get it. We're about to run through the gauntlet. We got a tough... Tough five game stretch. But we'll be fine. And I hear a whole lot of chirping out there in the South. I hear a whole lot of chirping in the South. Please motherfucking believe. That was just one bad out. Out of what? Huh? You better check the last motherfucking 14 games my Carolina Panthers have played and check our record. Because if you think goddamn Sunday is a microcosm of what's the fuck that ready to go on this season, well, you motherfuckers really don't know about no goddamn football. This NFL season has been quite interesting. We got some powerhouse teams taking L's. It's about to test characters all over this motherfucker. But you know, it's, it's been other so-called powerhouse teams that, that took L's, and you already seen what the fuck they done. But that's going to be for later on in the motherfucking year before I get to goddamn calling them suckers out. But anyway, this ain't that type of video. But Panther Nation, don't, don't be wet, Rich. We'll be just fine. It's only one loss. It's one loss. We have a tough matchup coming this week. We got the motherfucking Baltimore Ravens in Baltimore. Yeah, that's going to be a toughie. But we'll be fine. We'll show up this defense, learn from the mistakes, and keep motherfucking pounding. But don't hate me, you chump ass motherfuckers, because I'm just a motherfucking messenger. And uh, one more thing, the Baltimore Ravens, they got some trash talkers over there, and two in particular. I'll address that ass in a little bit. But here's my crow. A hey, good shit, Pittsburgh. Big Ben was flinging that motherfucker. God damn, y'all running that running that motherfucker all over our goddamn hell. Damn. Y'all to be proud. Cause that's something goddamn not many teams have been able to do. Check the stats. But I'm the voice and I'm out. I'll see y'all later on in the week.